Today is mine and Dan's synchro competition day, so we're going to head down to the pool now, warm up and get into the pool, and it's going to be the first time that we've done our competition since Beijing because we were unable to compete in Guangzhou, so it's time to... Competition! <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, it's time to head to the pool and warm up and get in to compete. It started off with an Ima one and a half pike and it was a solid start with 51 points. Our next dive was a reverse one and a half somersaults with half a twist. We were both a little bit quick so we were both a little bit splashy on the entry. Our Ima three and a half was really good timing and we just need to work a little bit more on our entries to get the higher points. Next up was a reverse three and a half which was pretty solid. I managed to get mine in pretty vertical and so was Dan's. Again, just need to work on the entries a little bit. Our front four and a half we've been working on the distance away from the board and today we matched. Had to finish off with a back three and a half somersaults pike. We were both a little bit slow and a little bit short. And ended up with a bronze. So we're back from the pool now and Dan and I came away with a bronze medal. So considering the preparation that we had leading into it with Dan's tricep, pretty happy with the way it went, but we do need to do a little bit more training and get a little bit more prepared leading into the final leg of the World Series. But now it's time to relax and get ready for my individual competition on Sunday. Good morning everyone, it is Sunday morning and I'm up bright and early because today I've got quite a long day actually. I've got the men's 10 metre individual event uh, this morning in the semi-finals and then if I make it through to the finals I've got that later. And immediately after the finals I've got the mixed synchro with Grace. So it's going to be a long, long day but it should be good fun. So I just finished the semi-finals and I'm pretty happy with the way it went. Nothing was too amazing and nothing was too bad. Uh, my reverse three and a half was a new starting dive for me. Started off pretty solid but I missed my hand. And then I went on to the inward three and a half which is normally my first dive. And it was solid enough just a little bit early out. Then I went on to twist which was steady. And then I did... What did I do next? Then I did arm stand back triple which again was another steady one. Uh, then I went on to do front four and a half, which was a little bit low finishing, and then I did back two and a half pike, where I closed my arms a little bit in front, but overall steady Eddie, and through to the final, qualifying in first in that semi-final. I just had some volunteers who said that they watched my vlogs, and they wanted to be in one, so now they're in a vlog. Say hello. Because our volunteers are here. Yes. Don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up. Oh, look <laughs> at that. So going back to the hotel now for a little bit of rest. Before the but look, it's actually snowing. It's all in my face and everything. These are going on to protect my ears. So rest time is over and I'm back at the pool and it's still snowing. So I'm going to get ready for the final. I'm going to do a bit of warming up and then right after the Temia final I've got the mixed synchro with Grace. So it's a busy afternoon but it should be fun. So I started off the final with a reverse three and a half and I managed to get three tens. Yeah boy! I then went on to the in with three and a half where I was a little bit chesty on the entry so I ended up going a little bit short. I then had my front three and a half with one twist and it was another solid one with 91.8 points. I then had my arm stand which I've been a little bit nervous on recently but it managed to go in pretty nice. I then had a front four and a half where I grabbed my knees a little bit high into my shake, so it was a little bit slow. Then I finished with my back three and a half pike and managed to get a bronze medal. And then I had to get ready for mixed synchro pretty quickly and so did Grace. It tastes so bad. It tastes like Malibu. Oh God. And why are you taking that? 
because I'm crashing. I've already competed and now I'm crashing. But I'm gonna go right back up. I'm gonna be ready. <laughs> Maybe, we'll see. Help me. For the mixed synchro, there was no training between the men's platform final and the mixed synchro event, so we had to go cold turkey. We started off with back half and there's a little bit of a difference with our distances from the board. We then had reverse dive pike, which I think was the best one that we've done in competition so far. And then we had inward two and a half pike, where the timing is getting better and better. And then for the first time, we had a front three and a half pike that was actually in time. Then we finished off with a pretty average back two and a half pike, but it was enough to get a medal. So Grace and I just got off the medal podium, but the, unfortunately, the camera battery died just as we were about to go on the podium. So look, we come away with a bronze medal. So that's three for three. Woo! So it is now midnight, and we leave for the airport in an hour, sat over couch, editing the video. So yeah, it's uh, about an hour until we leave. Our flight's at 3.50, we land at 9.30. It's gonna be a long night. The sooner we get home, night. the better. No sleep, and I feel like I'm always dreaming all night. No sleep. Can you tell we're tired? So yeah. Dan, will you shut up? Show me the Show me the money. No f's given. <laughs> So I'm now home from Russia and it was one hell of a journey overnight without really much sleep at all throughout the whole day. But now I get to spend the whole rest of my day with this one. It's noon, I'm starving, let's get breakfast. Okay, we're gonna go get breakfast now, so uh, don't forget to subscribe, give this a thumbs up, comment and all that kind of stuff because we're about to go and get breakfast and I've got the next leg of the World Series in a couple of weeks time in Canada. Oh, that was out of focus. Yeah. Now it's back in focus. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>